Hi, my name is Jordan Fernandes, and my demonstration speech will be learning on how to do a standing tuck. I know how to do a standing tuck because I have been a male cheerleader for five years and now a tumbling instructor at Cheer Factor All Stars who teach other kids on how to learn a standing tuck. Did you know that there are 4 million cheerleaders in 31 different countries and 3.82 million cheerleaders come from the USA? I think learning a standing tuck shows that you are an athletic, unique, and talented person as it is not easy to go backwards and flip your body. To land a standing tuck, it takes technique, but you also need to make sure that you do not have the fear of going backwards. I will now demonstrate you my standing tuck as I am the visual aid in this demonstration speech. The first thing, and it's most important before you do your standing tuck, is to make sure you look to the left, look to the right, and also behind you to make sure there is no other athletes that are tumbling and could get hurt. As you just saw, when I was starting my stand and tuck, I had my legs bent around a 90 degrees and my arms were all the way behind me. This is very important because this is the starting of your standing tuck and you want to make sure that this is good so you get your standing tuck as high as can be. When my feet finally take off the floor, you see that my arms are to my ears and my head is in instead of looking up to the sky and this is very important because this is also going to get us the height in our standing tuck. <clears throat> After this, you want to make sure that your arms get to your ears and they keep rotating all the way backwards until, the, until you grab the back of your legs, which will actually allow you to rotate in your standing tuck. Finally, your last step to landing a standing tuck is to make sure you spot your feet in your standing tuck which will allow you to finally see the floor and always make sure you tumble with your eyes open, never close, because that's always scary for everyone. But make sure you always, you wanna spot your feet so you see the floor and then you're gonna open up and then you will land your standing tuck. Thank you all for listening to my speech on how to do a standing tuck. I hope you all learned something new today. Um, thank you.